everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, as you can tell from the title, I'm back with a styling video and I'm very, 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 very excited about this one. I have titled it Styling Birkenstock Bostons or something along those lines. But I am going to hold my hands up and say I don't actually own Birkenstock Bostons. I have these from Boohoo instead, which basically look the same. They're the same idea. All the outfits will still work with the legit, the legit, I'm, that's a bit of a tongue twister, with the real Birkenstock Boston. They will still work, but I don't own the real ones. I just have a dupe. But dupe or not, wherever you've got your Birkenstock Bostons from, these outfits are some outfit ideas of things to wear with these. I don't know. I think they do different colours of Birkenstock Bostons, but I've gone obviously with this like nudie taupey colour just because it's what I've got in the Boohoo version. Um, I will leave these links down below though if you do want um, to get these because they are a really, really good dupe of the Boohoo, Bo Boohoo Boston. But what? They are a really good dupe of the Birkenstock Bostons and they're on a really good budget. That's a bit of a tongue twister. I feel like I'm Dr. Zeus saying that. Um, so many B words. They're good if you're on a budget. I think these were less than £20. So I'll leave them linked down below. Those, those, I'm really getting tongue twisted. These are the shoes I'm wearing. They still have a tag on because I ordered them in two sizes and these are the size up because I can't find the shoes that I actually own that I wear. I've only got one of them. So I thought I'd have two to hold up. But anyway, that is today's video. I'm showing you some outfit ideas for Birkenstock Bostons because they are definitely going to be like the shoe of this autumn winter, I think. I feel like Ultra Mini Uggs will still be so popular but they were like the shoe of last year and I feel like the shoe of this year are going to be these so I thought I'd do a dedicated video styling them giving you some outfit ideas in case you're thinking of getting them but you don't know what to wear them with we're going to go through some outfits I've got my laptop here as per usual for my styling videos but it is on charge because I didn't quite realize until I went to pick up for this video that it was completely dead so we've got the charging lead with us today but that's okay I am just going to get started I'll put my Instagram and my TikTok on screen here there will probably be some Instagram pictures over the next few weeks of me wearing the shoes with various outfits because I'm a big fan of them so if you want to see that make sure you follow me over on Instagram and I'm now getting on with styling some Birkenstock Bostons and showing you my outfit ideas. I have also just sprayed some hairspray to try and like keep my curtain bangs in place and I've inhaled half of it so now my mouth currently tastes like hairspray which is just delicious. The got to be glued is a good hairspray but it not tastes very nice so if I'm, I'm gonna blame that. If I get stumbled up on words or I say things wrong, I've also just realized that my cup of water that I'd brought for this video, I've left on my desk. So we're just gonna have to go without it. So I'm gonna have the hairspray taste in my mouth for the whole video because I now can't wash it away. But that does not matter. Okay, we're gonna start off with what I'm wearing. Just because I didn't really know where else to start, it kind of makes sense. So I currently have on this like jumpsuit from Missy Empire. I forgot I had this, found it in my like underbed storage the other day, tried it on for this video and now I absolutely love it. So I'm very, very glad, but it's basically this black jumpsuit and now my camera battery is flashing we're off to a great start i'm going to quickly change that which will change the setup which is really going to going to annoy me then we'll get on with the first outfit okay bear with me okay i'm back carrying on where i left off i was basically saying how i'm wearing this in the first outfit and i've gone with like a working from home style outfit comfy like kind of outfit with this one so i've got my fake airpod maxes is that what they're called you know the fake apple headphones i got them from shein they are incredible if you haven't seen my shein haul go over and watch that because i talk about them a little bit more in that and they're linked in that and blah 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 and you should watch that video anyway but anyway back to this video i'm going off on 12 different tangents here um i've got them on i've got the jumpsuit and then i've just got my laptop because my whole work is basically either on this camera or on my laptop so i'm either with one of them and because i was filming with the camera I thought would hold the laptop so that's my working from home vibes I had a coffee cup very conveniently mum had made me a coffee um, and I thought it kind of tied in with the working from home vibes and then I've got the Birkenstock Bostons on and I feel like this outfit would work if you're sorry the sun is just really overexposing this video right now everything is going wrong apparently let me just bear with because at the moment I don't think I've got any facial features because it's that overexposed anyway as I was saying I feel like this outfit would work as well if you were like going out the house maybe going to Starbucks to do some studying or like do some work or whatever it's just a comfy outfit like it doesn't necessarily have to be a work from home outfit but that's just I thought if we styled it around that it would like help this curtain man is really annoying anyway then next up I'm I'm gonna go mm, I was gonna go with that one but mm, I'm not sure now I don't know what order to do this in next up we have a bit of like a layered outfit so it's got some jeans in it which are from Pull and Bear I've got a cardigan in it from Shein which is kind of like open which I quite like and then a trench coat on from Shein as well a tote bag and then the Birkenstock Bostons and I just feel like the neutral tones work really well and I I feel like these shoes work so well with my wardrobe and with what I wear because 
because I tend to wear neutral colours, especially I've dropped it on the floor, so I'm gonna have to use this one, which is the other one. Um, especially with this kind of colour, this colour I wear a lot, this kind of like beigey colour. I'd say like I wear cream and beige more than I'd wear like black. So it just ties in with a lot of my like outfits, if that makes sense. And these are quite a similar colour to the cardigan, so I just feel like it really ties the whole outfit together and looks really, really good. And then similarly, I have this two-piece on from Zara which I thought looked really nice as well with the Birkenstock Boston's again because it's a similar colour um colour tone kind of colour palette so it looks really nice um like I said this is from Zara but I got it last autumn and winter but you could probably find it on Depop or Vinted if you wanted it um and I love this set again comfy you can wear it open wear it done up like I love a two-piece especially because I feel like a two-piece looks really put together anyway because they match and then to tie it in with shoes that are a similar colour it does look really good and I apologise for the lighting constantly changing in this video it's gone like sunny and cloudy and we all know my hate for that when filming because it just means the lighting keeps changing then going back to black i have these black wide leg trousers on from zara which i absolutely love they go so much i'm obsessed with them if you don't have a pair of black wide leg trousers in your wardrobe i really feel like you should because they just look so good with everything and i've got a simple black vest top on from Zara as well and then I've got a jumper on from Shein which actually again happens to be a similar colour to the shoes which I've realised now looking back at the trial clips that happened a lot partly because that is how my wardrobe is like a lot of my wardrobe like I said is that colour but also I feel like it does tie the outfit in together really well um, and the bag is just from Zara really really simple and the jumper itself is really lightweight which I like because I hate wearing jumpers tied around if they're really heavy so I just really like that it's a really really simple look but I do really really like it and then another black outfit that I have is a bit more of like an athleisure one I've just got some black leggings on these are from New Balance um, a sports bra from H&M and then like a zip up Lululemon style um, jacket from Shein and then just a tote bag and this again really comfy easy to chuck on if you're like running errands or whatever um, or if you've like been to the gym and then you for whatever reason you don't want to wear your gym trainers to pop to cost or whatever you could just slip on the Birkenstocks like they're so easy as well because you just literally can slip them on and you don't need to wear socks with them so like it's just an easy shoe to chuck on like or say for example if I was wearing this outfit around the house which I would do and then I needed to pop out or whatever for whatever reason or run out of the house quickly slip the Birkenstock Bostons on and they look really good do you know what I mean because we've got like crocs and stuff by the front door in our house to just like chuck on if you need to pop out the house and these are perfect because they're slip on but they're easy and they look good and then talking of comfy outfits and being at home I have this jumper dress on from Pretty Little Thing and then I've got these like high chunky really warm socks on from Zara and I quite like this like it kind of looks like you've had to quickly run out the house in a way but I also kind of like that I just think it's kind of cute and cozy and warm and you could definitely like style up a little bit more if you wanted to make it look a little bit more acceptable to wear out the house so you could like chuck on a big puffer jacket I think that would look really nice actually like a big oversized puffer wear it like that you could chuck on a trench with it um, add some scarves and stuff if you added a bag and stuff and maybe like put your hair in like a bun or like a nice slick back um like hairstyle I feel like it then makes it more appropriate to wear out the house you know what I mean like not that it's not appropriate but it kind of looks like a oh I've just chucked on this and I'm just quickly popping to Tesco sort of outfit but you could make it more of like a I'm going out for the day outfit that might make no sense to any of you but I really hope that it does and then another kind of comfy easy outfit is this one with my sisters and seekers serotonin t-shirt which is one of my all-time favorite items of clothing I wear it all the time and then I've got some black leggings on again they're from New Balance I've got some white socks on and then the Birkenstock Bostons and again just a simple easy outfit to chuck on like it shows you how they work as like I'm trying to show you like nice and more put together outfits and also like comfy outfits just to show you a range and I love this obviously you could swap it out with different outfits chuck on a tote bag with this and I feel like this is a cute like running errands I need to go to the post office and then I'm gonna pick myself up a coffee and I'm gonna I've put the headphones on to sort of show like I'm on my own I'm listening to my music I'm comfy but I also look kind of cool sort of like baggy oversized vibes I really don't know if what I make of what I'm saying makes sense but these are all the thought processes going on in my head and then going back to the black wide leg trousers um, I also got this like black crop top which is also from Zara and it's such a simple outfit but I really like it like it's just easy and I did actually see this outfit on Pinterest and it looked really cool so I feel like looking on Pinterest there's a lot of outfits that you can get ideas from with Birkenstock Bostons as well if you want if you're not fully persuaded yet on buying them or you want some more ideas have a look on Pinterest because they've got some really good outfits um but yeah really comfy I love like the little like croppedness though I feel like a crop tight a tight cropped top 
with the baggy trousers i just love the contrast and then talking of baggy wide leg trousers i have these white wide leg trousers from shein for the next outfit they're like white wide leg jeans but they're a little bit too big for me um but i've tried to make them work i've just put them on with like a white bodysuit from primark and then this blazer from white fox and again the blazer is a similar sort of earthy tone to the birkenstocks so it just ties in really well and i keep seeing like white wide leg jeans with blazers like all over pinterest and stuff and people are wearing them with trainers they're wearing them with mini uggs they're wearing them with birkenstock bostons and they look really good so i wanted to try and recreate that but the jeans are a little bit too big but i have just ordered some um white wide leg jeans from zara to try so if i put together any outfits with those jeans then i'll insert them in here so you can see them i haven't yet but i might you know i might do we'll see and then i've got a bit more of like a put together smart outfit i've got some jeans again from pull and bear the same trench coat from shein that I, I mentioned in another outfit and then i just have this um white ralph Lauren shirt on although you can't even tell like where it's from it's just a white shirt basically i've tucked half the shirt in and left half out and then i've got the bostons on and i just wanted to do a jeans outfit to show you that they don't not only work with like neutral colors but they do work really well with like denim jeans i think they look so nice together and i love this kind of outfit like it's kind of comfy the shoes make it a little bit more chill but it's also put together with the trench coat and the shirt like i love this i don't know why i didn't mention this one more towards the start because it's one of my favorites i'm not really sure what's going on there but i will i also feel like i'm talking at about fifty thousand miles per hour um but we are getting there do i have oh no please don't tell me oh no that wasn't the last one i was gonna say don't tell me that was the last one because i didn't realize that was the last one but it wasn't um i do also have this clip of the cardigan that i showed um let me just retrace my steps a second the trench coat outfit with the cardigan from shein that i showed towards the start um i've just done a clip with the cardigan and the jeans just to show you them together because i think they look quite nice like the cardigan does work really well with the jeans i probably wouldn't wear just this outfit out of the house because it's a little bit basic i'd probably want to add something to it but to be fair if you just added a couple of necklaces a nice bag with it i feel like it is then put together do you know what i mean but it's just at the moment it's a bit stripped bare it needs a bit of adding to it but i just wanted to show you the cardigan with the bostons because i just love them together and then lastly for this video if i have any other outfit ideas for the birkenstock bostons that i haven't mentioned i'm going to insert them in here quickly just so you can see them but like i said there will be more outfit ideas over on my instagram and tiktok as well so make sure you follow me over on there but the last outfit idea for this video is this um waistcoat waistcoat like sleeveless jumper-esque type thing from zara which I think I got like two years ago. I don't think I got it last year, but they tend to release like, look at this lighting, like what is going on? But they tend to release these kind of jumpers every single year. And again, you can look on Depop or Vinted. So I've got that wearing over a shirt. And because the shirt wasn't quite long enough, I have just put on some white shorts underneath because otherwise it would have been too short. But ideally wear like a longer shirt. So it's just like an oversized shirt with the jumper on top. It's kind of like a preppy look. And again, similar tones to the Birkenstocks. I just obviously love that kind of vibe. Um, and the bag is from Zara. So that's it is the last outfit for this video apologies for the lighting fluctuating and changing a lot throughout this video hopefully it won't annoy you as much as it annoys me because it really bugs me but i'm just extra fussy with things like this when it comes to filming um but yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and that it gave you some ideas and some inspiration for some outfits let me know if you've got any ideas yourself below um and let me know if there's any other videos you want to see give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and i shall see you at some point soon another one bye